Okay, so I wanted to tell you about uh, what happened with Harbor Freight. Uh, you may, some of you may be familiar, there was a class action lawsuit against Harbor Freight. And uh, this is something I learned about on the internet, someone told me about. This is, goes back about a year ago. Uh, they, there was a website that said if you had uh, gone shopping at Harbor Freight, uh, there was a, a lawsuit against them based upon some alleged misrepresentation of the what the actual price was. There was a sale price, uh, wasn't it was misleading. These are the allegations anyway. It was misleading that uh, because it, it didn't reflect a comparison to an actual price. No one really knows what the prices are at Harbor Freight anyway. They change all the time. You never know what the sale price is. So uh, basically, you can sign up on the Harbor Freight website. I don't think you could do it anymore, but this go back about a year ago. You sign up, they offered you a $10 gift card uh, to Harbor Freight if the case was successful. And uh, so I did. And actually, I'm in a unique situation because I always sent uh, my friends, I have friends who work in the area, and if I wanted something at Harbor Freight, I would send them to Harbor Freight. They'd go, they'd pick something up for me. So quite a few of my friends went to Harbor Freight to buy things. So they were all, they all qualified, they all bought things. Uh, at Harbor Freight, so I had them all sign up for the Harbor Freight uh, class action lawsuit. Um, and basically, I was waiting for the gift cards to come, and I kind of forgot about it. And after a year, uh, about a year, um, they did come in the mail. And I was, so I was excited. I was going to get the Harbor Freight, the $10 gift cards. And so my friends called me up. Uh, they got the gift cards and they, they wanted to know they, they don't really shop they shop for me so whatever so I got them um, and when I opened up the envelope uh, it had a gift card and it said in it um, surprisingly it didn't say $10 gift card it said here's your gift card from the uh, class action lawsuit it's a $160 gift card I said that's crazy a $160 gift card Yep, it was a, apparently it's a hundred and sixty dollar gift card. So I got one. My friends got them, and they don't need them. They don't really care about Harbor Freight. They go shopping for me. So I got two. I mean, if they buy something, and some of it they did buy for themselves, but it wasn't much. They're not into tools. And I got four. So I got four gift cards from Harbor Freight. So it's one hundred sixty dollars each. Is about six hundred forty dollars for all four. I don't even know what I'm going to do with that. I mean, I, I'd rather buy stock in Harbor Freight than buy all the stuff that they sell, but I don't know if it's a mistake, so I'd rather not store it on the gift card and actually go shopping for things. So we're going to go tomorrow to Harbor Freight, and be as it may, it's also uh, Memorial Day, so you got this big sale at Harbor Freight, they got the 25% off coupons, and I think you could use one per person, so my friend, he got the, uh, this, um, just the, you got this coupon and I got one as well so I'm gonna I may split the order just to be able to use two coupons two 25% offs because it's you know in the good old days you get like 25% off your whole order now it's like 25% off it says in some fine print any single item you're familiar with that right uh, any single item so they're having a really good sale and uh, for instance they have these lights which is usually about they says 399 or more now the two ninety nine, um, you got these titanium bit sets, twenty nine piece bit set for nine ninety nine. I'll get like maybe two of those. Of course, the free flashlights and stuff. Um, but pretty much, there's lots and lots of coupons here. Got that good screwdriver, ninety nine cents. Um, so I'm sure most of you got this in the mail. Uh, if you don't get it, just sign up with uh, your address with Harbor Freight, and they'll mail you the stuff. Of course, everything is renewal required. They're always having a liquidation sale. Uh, not that it means much, but basically, so we'll go tomorrow, and uh, I'm gonna go with a relative, we're gonna go to Harbor Freight, and do some damage. That won't be painful, because we got the gift card. So, we'll take a look, and I'm looking for some of the things that I haven't really bought, because I couldn't really justify it. I didn't really need it that much, but I really wanted to have it. Like, this is a 60-piece tap and die set I kind of always wanted one because occasionally I need one but I just couldn't spend the money on it so for $39.99 that baby's mine and uh, we'll take a look we'll see what's in the store tomorrow and uh, we'll take it up then all right so we're at Harbor Freight and it's pouring which is great because there's nobody in the store 
awesome. So we'll take a look and see what we can get. the ones with the solid wheels. Uh, dun, dun, dun. I don't see it though. It's great. Nobody's in the store. Awesome. Oh, here's my hand trucks. I don't see the one with the solid tires, which is what I want. All right, take a look. So I'm back from Harbor Freight, and uh, it was good. It was, it was a rainy day today, so there weren't too many people in the store. But surprisingly, uh, they didn't have uh, some of the things that I was looking for. I wanted to get the cart, the metal cart with the solid wheels uh, to replace mine. That's all beaten up, but uh, they did not have that. So um, couldn't get everything I wanted. Some of the other tools I had, they didn't. They didn't have I want, things I wanted, um, so I picked up a couple of things. Like I said, I had about I had six hundred forty dollars in credit. I spent about two hundred dollars, so at least I know the cards actually work, which is great. Um, and uh, I'll show you some of the things I got. I got this actually a gift from my brother-in-law. Uh, this uh, hundred thirty-piece toolkit. I don't remember. So I think it was like. Uh, $35 or so. I don't know if it's... Let's see what it is. Actually, it's sealed, but... Let's see if we can... Let's see what's in there. Alright, hold on. So the thing with Harbor Freight is I think when you look in the magazine, it everything looks great. It looks like it's really useful. But when you get there and you actually see it and you touch it, you're like, a lot of it is just junk. Um, I love the store, but it's just, you know, some of it is just, if you like good things. In any event, yeah, so this, just, this will be a gift for my brother-in-law who's not that handy and doesn't buy tools. So take a look at it. All right, so it looks like that. Looks pretty good. Just gonna have to put some of these screwdrivers back in. Like you see, it doesn't really fit in well where it should hold. Whatever, what can you expect? So, I'll just put that together. All right, so I put everything back. I mean, this toolkit is good for someone who has no tools. Like my brother-in-law, and who doesn't know how to fix much of anything. So maybe this will get him to uh, start to fix things so he won't call me over as much. Um, tape, some ratchets, a little hammer. It's okay. Some little nails. One. Yeah, stuff doesn't really hold in here. Whatever. And that's pretty much it. All right, so I think the main thing is when you go to Harbor Freight, you gotta know what's good. A lot of it's junk. Ah, this is a friend asked me to get him. So uh, it'll be my gift to him. The ammo can. This actually seems pretty good. He has ammo. So. Grab it. Very solid. Looks good. Um, you know, I tried splitting my order in two to try to take use of. Uh, Two of these 25% off coupons and stuff.
But uh, they don't they don't let you. They only let you uh, use one coupon per day per person. All right, so let's see what else. Um, I got two of these that I like. I really like these magnetic uh, holders. These are awesome. They work really well. It's good. And I got this wedge, actually for chopping, splitting wood. You know, I bought all the stuff that I probably wouldn't buy otherwise, except for the fact that I had uh, all that credit. I got a, a Doyle cutting pliers, got these Bauer drill bits, center punch. They changed the free flashlight. It's uh, the LEDs a little different. Uh, um, all right. Seems a little brighter, a little better designed. Um, then you get this and epoxy for whatever reason. Crazy glue, I think it was 49 cents for the coupon. I got a couple of these, I got these neat little light switches. Very bright, I gotta tell you. All right. We got some more light switches. Another light switch. I have a couple of closets that need them. These brushes, I think they were a dollar each. So I got one, two, three, four. Another brush. Um, got this. You can't go wrong with silicone spray. It's good for the snow blower. It keeps the uh, snow from freezing on the blades. Look this hook. I think it was 99 cents. Another brush. One of these big brushes, bench brush, good for picking up dirt. I got this, which I, I had before, but I think my plumber stole from me when he was fixing something in the boiler room. Um, I like this. This is one of those. And they always seem to be sold out of this one. I think this one was four bucks. See? really nice so you got the basics the very good grip handle put it in it's good if you're running like let's say to help someone you can just grab this and pretty much you got it covered I actually like these drill bits now that I'm thinking about it I don't know. These are actually more money. I think they were 25 bucks, something like that. So that was good. I couldn't find the drill bit sharpener that I wanted. They didn't have that. Okay, and I got This, I, I thought this would be a good idea. Universal joint set, so you can reach hard to reach places. And then I got this um, the flex head ones. I had a need for it at times to reach difficult to reach bolt, so I got that. And uh, that'll join me, it'll join over here in my uh, US General cart. Um, I can't really show you over here. Oops, everything's falling, but I got a bunch of stuff in there. And I got more drawers over here. I'll probably put the wrenches in here. Maybe over here. This card is great. I saw the new version, which 
opens wider. It's about the same. Um, so what happened today is basically I spent about uh, $200 in credit. Um, I have about, I had 640 so I have about, I think, $440 left. So I really don't know what else to buy there. I mean, a lot of stuff's junk. Um, I think what I'm looking to get is um, next time I paint, I'm going to get that spray gun. They have one. It hooks up to a paint can for usually about $149, $159. Um, I didn't get the, I was looking at a 100-foot uh, cord, either electrical cord. I wanted that one and also a 100-foot hose. But the quality didn't seem that great. So I didn't, I just didn't get it. Um, so, in any event, uh, so far it was a good success, and it looks like the, uh, I, I don't know how they gave out this, uh, these cards at $160, like when they said it was supposed to be $10. So, I, I wanted to at least spend some of it, so uh, they couldn't take back the money. But, it's nice to go on a shopping spree on someone else's dime, and uh, it really was a lot of fun. So, uh, hopefully you guys are uh, having fun out there. I see a lot, some of these people selling these gift, these gift cards on Craigslist. And uh, hopefully you're enjoying yours if you got one. And uh, that's it. If you have any other ideas of how I should spend the rest of the, the uh, $440 balance at Harbor Freight, what tools you like, uh, just put in a comment and I will uh, look into buying it. Other than that, Hope you subscribe, enjoy, and happy holidays.